Hey all, thanks for tuning in to another episode of uh, Travel with Carter. Here I am in beautiful Taiwan and can't wait to dive in and show you all about it. But first, let me just talk about this um, beautiful mustache I have. So I grow it every year in uh, November as part of Movember. And Movember is all about men's health, both physical and uh, mental. So uh, again, I have type 1 diabetes and um, I feel like crap if I don't take my medication daily. So I, I have to monitor it, I have to keep it in uh, uh, in check. And that, that might be the same for some of you. So whether mentally or physically. So again, there is help available. Please uh, do get checked out by your, your family doctor um, or professional if you're uh, needing some help. Secondly, it's uh, Diabetes Awareness Month. So again, I'm doing my part with this channel, trying to be the first person with type 1 diabetes to go to every single country in the world. And uh, just want to, yeah, uh, hopefully motivate some people, let you know that uh, uh, you can have a normal life. You can do a lot of great things, even though you got this uh, uh, tough illness. But things are getting better. Uh, the medication's improving. The uh, uh, monitoring tools are getting better. So, you know, fingers crossed that, uh, you know, in my lifetime, we can uh, hopefully have a cure. But in the meantime, um, again, there is lots of uh, good resources out there. So again, if you're interested in learning more, please check out uh, movember.ca or movember.com or uh, diabetes.ca or diabetes.com. And again, tons of research out there and uh, help available for those that need it. So enjoy the episode. Stay golden. Thanks for, for the support and thanks for watching. Here we go, playoff baseball. Waiting in line to buy a ticket here. Hopefully we get it. Fingers crossed. to be here it's uh, game six and it's the dragons against the monkeys let's go Sorry to pause the video right here, but I, I need to ask a favor. Can you please hit that subscribe button down below? It would really help me out greatly as I try to be the first person with type 1 diabetes to go to every single country in the world. Now that being said, you're not just doing it for me, there is something in it for you as well. So I gave away a, a prize pack at uh, 500 subscribers and I committed and said I would do it for every time my subscriber counts doubled from then on. So uh, I've hit a thousand. I cannot wait to hit another uh, a milestone of 2000. I'll do the same thing at 4000. And again, I will give out a nice prize pack and ship it to the winner um, from whatever country I'm in at the time. So I'll get some local goodies, uh, a little flag and uh, other keepsakes. Uh, so please hit that subscribe button, tell a friend, tell a family member and continue watching. Stay golden all. Gelato, in a cute baseball uh, helmet, so why not, that's a little fun for a baseball game. The 
Michigan Stadium here and they are uh, giving out uh, free t-shirts as part of the uh, uh, playoff festivities, make sure they got the home field advantage, so I, I was able to get one. And uh, yeah, they got it really, really set up amazing, so it's nice and, uh, nice and orderly, and uh, yeah, everybody that bought a certain type of ticket uh, gets free free t-shirts, so that's, uh, that's something you can get for free in Taiwan, so that's pretty incredible. I got my uh, t-shirt and I'll show it off in a minute. That's kind of neat. 156 people at once throwing out the uh, ceremonial first pitch. So they got the Guinness World Record here, the uh, uh, Dragons. Hey Blue Jays, all you gotta do is 157. Kaohsiung, um, I think I said it right, hopefully I said it right, uh, but uh, yeah, Kaohsiung uh, Arena to see Coldplay this evening. Got my uh, Coldplay shirt, I thought it uh, said Coldplay when I saw it, so why not, let's get after it. And just a, a reminder, for any of you new at traveling, I say take the subway, take the train, just get out, explore a little bit. It's uh, um, teaches you a lot, It's uh, especially in a different language. Um, but yeah, I would highly recommend it. It's fun, it's safe in most countries, and um, yeah, it, it's just a good, uh, uh, convenient way to do it. So it's gonna be about a two and a half hour commute down there. 
Here we go. So I think it's about an hour and a half. Yeah. Aha. Transformers are real here in Taiwan. There you go. It's all those cool plates I have. All right, here we go. We got the ticket in hand. Going to Coldplay shortly. Let's uh, check out what's going on around the stadium first. So this is uh, all sorts of food and uh, this is the beer line. That's a big line, okay. All sorts of food here. So we'll have to try a few of those before we jump into the stadium. All right, so I got one of these to start. So, and you get to choose your dry rub. Here we go, I got um, mustard, dry mustard to start. Let's give it a try. It is packed here, there's a lot of people. Okay. All right, here we go, Will you give it a try. That is smoking good. Here goes nothing. Show's about to start here in uh, Kaohsiung. 80,000 people. Feel like an ant here.
a couple more tips for you guys. Uh, so you can't take an Uber from the airport into Taiwan, but uh, or sorry, Taipei, but uh, you can vice versa. So um, you got to take a regular taxi or the train. So I would probably recommend the train. I showed up at like midnight, um, so the train wasn't an option for me. I was pretty beat. Uh, so I took a taxi, but uh, yeah, Uber is available on the, the way back. <laughs> Breakfast of champs. I've been eating this for days um, while, while here in Taiwan, having a blast. Some more nudes. Look at these. These uh, rich broth. I don't know what I got here. If it's uh, beef or pork or, or something else. <laughs> About to dive in. Give it a whirl. Nice, uh, beautiful vegetables. This looks incredible. Nice loud restaurant. This is kind of what we want. This is uh, authentic. Give it a try here. Oh, it smells so good. so good this whole thing <laughs> is basically two meals in one but I'll do my best to, to try to finish it all right so uh, travel is never straight up and down um, from here to there there's always a little bit of uh, confusion and chaos and that's partly what I love about it uh, that's where I experience some of the, the best moments when they're unplanned and uh, also frustrating on the other end so uh, currently in uh, Shanghai I was leaving uh, Taiwan on my way to uh, Laos and uh, yeah stuck in Shanghai for about uh, 24 hours or 20 hours as my uh, uh, plane was delayed the initial plane and uh, um, but yeah just uh, uh, trying to make the most of it I thought it was the cutest thing I couldn't play it because YouTube would demonetize me but uh, um, they just had a uh, street sweeping water truck go by cleaning the streets and it was playing it's a small world after all by uh disney song so very very cute shanghai does have a disney here and um it is uh, uh everywhere that i've seen i've only uh, been out for a few uh hours but uh yeah disney is uh very prevalent here and yeah just some uh, beautiful uh, buildings great restaurants and we'll see what i can get up to in a couple more hours It's officially the cutest uh, street cleaner I've ever seen. Good job, Shanghai. All right, so again, um, briefly over in Shanghai and uh, why not capitalize on it by having some amazing food? <clears throat> so, one of my favorites, these are uh, steamed pork dumplings and a really nice beer here, Sing Tao. up here I had some noodles this morning didn't film it got uh, barked at numerous times by uh, the ladies working there and uh, they dropped off a fork in my noodles as uh, I guess I looked like I was struggling but uh, I think I got it uh, the chopsticks 
give it a little dunk here in the, in the sauce and some regrets on that one. I should have waited another minute, <clears throat> but the beer will help cool it down. All right, I think I'm uh, maybe smarter than the system doing a little reverse engineering on these just to let out some of the uh, steam. So again, these are all handmade. There we go, I just see some of the steam coming out. They're still smoking hot. I uh, tried a second bite and yeah, I got the uh, severe burns going on, but um, delicious nonetheless. Just need to let it cool off. All right, feeling hopefully better about this one. Oh. See, I, I just jinxed myself saying how I had the chopsticks down. I clearly don't. Really, really good. This uh, sauce here, it's bitter, salty. Goes so good together with this uh, pork. Really enjoying it. And again, this is uh, quite cheap. So this is, um, uh, I gotta do the math, but um, I think it's like eight bucks. Um, so maybe not cheap, but uh, I thought it was reasonable. All right, I'm bad. This is uh, nudes number two of the day. These are a little bit thinner, but um, nice and peppery. Tons of cut up uh, hot peppers here, chili peppers. I've already had a couple bites, but uh, one for the can. Here we go. This is uh, <laughs> maybe why they thought I needed a fork earlier. Tons of fresh flavors there. We got uh, um, fresh ch cut up chilies, uh, both red and green chilies. You can see those. Uh, chives and uh, um, spring onions. It's delicious. As you can see, it's steaming up here. Ooh, yeah. All right, thanks so much for watching another episode of Travel with Carter. Uh, I'm taking off here from uh, Taipei, uh, heading to Laos uh, for a week, and then, um, yeah, back to Canada. But uh, uh, uh Taiwan, for a wonderful time here. You guys were wonderful, and um, this might be the quietest airport in the world. And uh, yeah, uh, if you're enjoying what you're watching, please hit that subscribe button down below tell a friend tell a family member that's how I grow as a channel that's how I get better and uh, can do this full-time and um, yeah uh, tune in next week as we go to a new country can't tell you uh, where just yet it's probably gonna be Laos as uh, I'm heading there right now but uh, yeah tune in next week to uh, watch the episode stay golden all